Hey guys, it's Queen of Fantasy. Today I'm doing a reaction video on the new originals that Mattel has released for their Ever After High. And yeah, so this one is Chris, know, Crystal Winter's Daughter of the Snow Queen and, or Elsa, you know. And um, I really don't see anything that's wrong with this doll except for she has painted on tights. And basically her hair is just like Twyla's. Uh, but I honestly don't see anything wrong with it. Next we have Michelle Mermaid. I honestly don't like the name to this. I, it might have to be pronounced as Michelle, but I'm just going to call her Michelle for right now. But, um, and I, I like the hair of this doll, to be honest. I also like the headpiece and the purse, but I don't like the face. You know, her face looks like a man. You have to be honest, though. It looks like a man. The eyebrows are fluffy, and yeah. Her, I like that they added a tail on her, though, but I just don't like that yellow thing. Next, we have Julian Beanstalk. I personally like this one. I think I'll be purchasing her when she hits stores or Amazon. But, again, what I don't like about her is her freaking man face. Cut off the crap, Mattel. Seriously. You put a man face on these dolls, making them look like crap. Um, but I do like her hair and her dress and her crown and stuff, so I guess she's okay. Except for the man face! Ah! Like, why? Next, we have Zeta Fumbolina. Um, I honestly like this one. I'll also be purchasing this one. Um, I like her flower crown, and I love her dress. It, I think it fits the character really well. And um, I also like the name that they put with this one. Also, um, I like that Mattel is bringing in darker skin tone dolls in, which I personally like. And she doesn't have a man face, which I also like. But I also don't get why they put white hair with this doll. But, you know, she looks by far the best out of all these dolls that I've reviewed so far. So, you know, that's always good to have at least one good doll. Next, we have Daring Charming, which finally, Mattel, you make a Daring doll. Like, seriously, I've been waiting for a long time for this thing to come out. But, um, they made Daring, but the only thing is, he looks like freaking Alistair. Except his face is smaller, he's a big forehead and a tiny chin. And his hair is almost the same as Alistair's, except it's kind of poofed up a little. And then, but I wish also his crown was face, like, on top of his head, more than, like, in the back. His jacket is too fluffy at the top. His, looks like his jacket doesn't even open, but at least the details are right. That's kind of a good idea that he comes with a mirror, but why the frick does he come in a pack with Rosabella? Like, if this becomes canon, I'm gonna shoot Mattel in the face. Why? I don't get them together, to be honest, but I guess Rosabella looks good. But I'm not really reviewing her because she's not an original. But she looks good. Once again, her glasses come on the side. But, you know, Mattel's just stupid like that. They don't put it on their face. Um, she looks normal except for a little bit of new clothing and stuff. But, yeah. These dolls are okay. That's all for this little rant. Please like, comment, subscribe for more. And, yeah, so have a nice day.